welcome to the 199th episode of Salesian News Asia Pacific. I'm your host RJ Bryan of Radio Salesian 90.8 FM, the voice of the hills, the first community radio of Don Bosco Asia since 2016. This show is brought to you by Church Art Kolkata, the church decor people. The headlines this week. Boscom launches new initiative for Salesian family. Value Education Fair enthralls children. Strategies Workshop draws fund seekers. 1,300 students perform Shakespeare's Merchant of Venice. Media Perspectives and Practices Seminar held. 40 cooperators from three units meet. The news in detail. India Boscom launches new initiative for Salesian family. South Asia Boscom coordinator Father Ernest Rosario reports from Chennai. On 2nd March 2024, members of Boscom, Salesian Media Network of South Asia, launched its new initiative, the Luminata Project. Luminata derives from Matthew chapter 6, verse 16, where Jesus says, let your light shine. The group hopes to be a Salation Family Media Forum for animation, education, production and research. In the online meet, there were some 60 participants, including social communication delegates of provinces and commission members and Salation Family Media animators and lay members involved in the media ministry. The guest speaker, Secretary of Catholic Bishops' Conference of India for Social Communications New Delhi, Father Dr. Biju Alapat, spoke on Pope's message for World Day of Social Communications on the theme, Artificial Intelligence and the Wisdom of the Heart towards a fully human communication. It was followed by participants breaking into chat rooms for interactions. Father Ernest Rosario reporting. In the heart of every dream lies the power to inspire. Introducing a timeless masterpiece that captures the essence of a visionary's dream. Behold the embodiment of Don Bosco's dream at nine years of age, a symbol of hope, compassion and the unwavering spirit to make a difference. Transform any space into a sanctuary of inspiration with our exquisite statues and murals. Perfect for schools, churches and community centers, a constant reminder of the power of dreams. Church Art Kolkata, the church decor people. churchart.ganguly at the rate gmail.com 9198310 India Value Education Fair enthralls children. Father Ashwin Makwan reports from Dakor, Gujarat. The 29th Value Education Day was celebrated at Don Bosco Dakor in Gujarat on 29th February 2024 by Amruddara Don Bosco Animation Center. The event was culmination of year-long value education workshops and sessions participated by six schools and 475 grade 9 students. For the day-long program, the students were divided into groups with the names of values that they had studied during the year. Icebreakers by Salesian Youth Movement volunteers helped participants to interact with each other. The students put up an exhibition with attractive and creative charts, as well as logbooks prepared by the different schools. During the cultural program, each group of students presented song and skit on the theme Love Brings Peace and Unity. Amruddara Don Bosco Catechetical Animation Center in Kapadwan, Gujarat was established in the year 1995. Father Ashwin Makwan reporting. <laughs> Thank you.
India Strategies Workshop draws fund seekers. Ms. Satabdi Roy Shaw reports from Kolkata. Corporate Social Responsibility, CSR Compliance and Strategy Workshop held on 1st March in Nitika Don Bosco drew over 80 hopeful fund seekers from Kolkata and districts. The program Organized by Bosconet India in collaboration with Don Bosco Development Office Kolkata was patronished by both men and women members of Conference of Religious India. Six members of Salesian College Autonomous participated in the program. Bosconet Don Bosco Network harnesses resources for the efforts of sustainable future of India by Don Bosco India, spanning 28 states, 11 interstate planning and development organizations, and 350 plus NGOs. The chief resource person at the workshop was master trainer for corporate affairs Mr. Nikhil Pant of Lakshya Foundation and Ms. Lishaka Gulati of Richa Foundation. As former Chief Program Executive, National Foundation for CSR, Ministry of Corporate Affairs, Government of India, Mr. Pant played a key role from government side in formulation and nationwide rollout of CSR as per Section 135 of Companies Act 2013, Legislation, Rules, Policy, Strategy and Compliance. Mr. Pant encouraged Bosconet to set up a CSR Center for Excellence which could provide ground-level support and coordinate CSR project proposals. Ms. Satabdi Roy Shah reporting. <laughs>
and join the Recreation Day for fellow Salesian cooperators of Northeastern Thailand. The program consisted of three groups, Ban Don Bosco Udon Thani, Ban St. Mary Udon Thani, and Ban Visutthiwong Pon Soong Udon Thani, totaling 40 people. Father Smith Dang Ampan gave a talk on the theme, Jesus Heals the Blind Man of Jericho, at Don Bosco Wittia School, Udon Thani Province. After the spiritual recollection, there was a meeting of the Mobile District Advisory Committee. Currently, there are 192 full-placed members in 13 various groups in Thailand and one group in Phnom Penh, Cambodia, with Mrs. Nawapon Kiswat as the provincial coordinator. Father Nipon Sarajit and Sister Subhawan Chotipon are provincial delegates for respective groups. Father Sufot Ryungam reporting. Next week, we bring you our glorious and uninterrupted 200th episode before we take a break in the broadcasting of both radio and YouTube episodes of Salesian News Asia Pacific. Yes, you heard it right. We are going off the air after the 200th episode. That's all for now from all of us at Radio Salesian. This show was brought to you by Church Art Kolkata, the Church Decor People.